Just had the shit scared out of me. There's the old Bill going down there. That, that my friends, is Mr. P.C. Harrison. You handsome bugger you. Yeah, he saved my life. I did do a video the other day, I interviewed him. He'll tell you for about 17 minutes. And I tried uploading it, but um, I can film Agora. I just said, no, can't do. That's, that's, you can't upload the old Bill film Agora. But he's just knocked me van and like we had a little discussion. It's gone it's nice and quiet because them two BMWs are gone. I went, look, I never call you, do I? And I goes, you're a persistent bugger, you are. Because he, he saved me life knocking at the door. Wouldn't, wouldn't give up the man. So you probably didn't, well, you, I know you definitely didn't see the old video there, Mr. Harrison, but that's the policeman that saved my life. Bloody hero he is. You know, that's how police should be. Like, a decent, he just knocked the van there. He goes, show everything all right. I went, yeah, mate, not a problem. And he, let go. he introduced me to a lovely blonde lady called Laura, fit as, and uh, that was it. He just went off again. He said, yeah, it's nice and quiet around here. Them two BMWs are gone. Damn right, Mr. Harrison. i never call you because I'll never give you work. It's that other toss put to give you the work. And there weren't no work there anyway. He just made up bullshit. Oh, and the made up bullshit was I, I run an electrical cable across the path. Yeah, I did. Test out me bleeding uh, hookup. And then I shouted through a fucking closed window. Geezer grasped me up, the little rats, to the housing officer and the police. And my old neighbour Trish just turned back up. I haven't told her about all the scandal that's gone on with the old grass and all that. But yeah, she just turned up with some biscuits for Lee. What a lovely thing to do. Because Lee gave her a bit of a sofa bread. A sofa bed! What's a sofa bread? Just had Kudzi round for another hour. Gonna go and pick him up, take him down in a minute after his shower. I should have asked him. I've just pulled his socks down about three days ago, four days ago. And I ain't 100% sure it's still, like, fresh. So, uh, Kudzi will probably tell me off. But, yeah, just had him round for an hour. We were talking about blood diamonds. Uh, the east of Zimbabwe, a place called Morangay. And diamonds are uh, in 2008 just appeared out of nowhere. And what did Mugabe do? Sent in his troops, displaced the people, villages of people, got rid of them. Uh, I can't really say no more than that because it's on the news that bit. He showed me some news clippings and that. Unbelievable. Corrupt politicians everywhere. So, anyway, doing another bit of uh, meat stew tonight. Gonna season that up now, a bit of salt and pepper. Have a cup of tea and take, uh, nearly called him Moringa. <laughs> take him to town, the uh, Dudzi. Always make a bloody mess, me. A little game of peekaboo. Little security man. Giving it Charlie Big Spuds. No, he's just come out having a little chill. My chosen spot, where's the old Mackie D? I ain't been there for ages, you know, but the McDonald's, uh, the one at Western Favel is a fucking shite. Horrible, always tastes like sunflower oil with their burgers. Can't believe it, Northampton, 5 1 against Plymouth, or Portsmouth, one of the two. Unbelievable. Portsmouth, yeah. Just sitting here chilling, waiting for the big fight tonight, three o'clock in UK time. Israel Desanya, he's, he's moving up to heavyweight. Now the guy he's fighting, Polish power, Jan Blakovic, whatever his fucking name is. Bronkovic or some fucking bitch, bitch. Anyway, he's a fucking savage. He is a savage. Oh my days. He beat, he beat Costa, never been beaten before. Right. I just worry for Sonia because if you get a slap off a Polish power, man, that could that could fucking kill you. Oh, and I'm not joking, but our, uh, the Sonia, he done it in um, kickboxing. He moved up from light heavy to heavyweight. He done it in fucking uh, in boxing itself. He went up to heavyweight, and now he's doing it in UFC. This is going to be bigger than Conor McGregor's double title, I think, definitely. Yeah, Conor McGregor's a puss-puss anyway, cokehead. Motherfucking cokehead he is. 
But anyway, here I am, nearly six o'clock on a Saturday night, recushioning me uh, sponges. Prefer a Victoria sponge to tuck into, to be honest, but hey ho. Oh, right, mate. So I could just come up. Oh, There's banks are going into the shop, the old terrorist. Oh, no. So I went up Western Fable, put the money in, drew hundred pounds. <laughs> He's ain't cut it off. So with drew hundred pounds, fucking thing. The geezers come up to me behind me. Goes, oh, do you drive, ride that unicycle? I went, no. Nah, listen to me, lad. He's a terrorist. He's a joker. So anyway, waiting for me hundred pounds. Fucking gives me the card back and he says. Take your card and please take your hundred pounds. Fucking didn't give me no money. And then it just went ATM not working. So I've just come up Goldings, met Banksy, and thank fuck, my balance was the same. It didn't take the hundred. It's just Banksy's a bit camera shy, like the rest of the boys. <laughs> yes, sir. Name two days of the week that begins with a T. Today and tomorrow. Stupid like lads in Bentley. Look. Trying to ventilate. Ventilate. Waiting for the boss man, Israel Ziani, to fucking destroy the Polish power. I don't know if this can happen. I'm worried about Israel, but it is what it is. Right, time to get home. Oh, I've waited all night for this. Hopefully I can <laughs> stay the course. But it's like when I, used to, when I was a kid, you wake up for Mike Tyson. And it'd be a knockout in 17 seconds. He's like, what the fuck? Hope you're well, guys. Good night. God bless. Take care. Look at this state of it. Oh, I'm... Where? Before I go, look. Fuck me, look. Insulation everywhere. Absolute disgrace, look. We're getting there, though, guys. Uh, for us, but oh, me mate, he's he lost his role to Siani. He lost to the Polish power. The uh, Jan uh, Brokovic, whatever his bloody name is. Seriously tough, man. Well, I made it till three o'clock and then the preliminary rounds fight started, sorry. I couldn't, I flagged out, I had to tap out. But I woke up this morning to uh, Israel lost and he's... He done himself proud, I watched the fight. He done himself proud. The Polish power, he's just, he's a savage. Look at the size of him. He's like a Viking, man. He's like an Icelandic geezer. Good genetics. Right, have a bit of breakfast and out to Bentley, I suppose. Still, still a bit of lean from last night, so I'm not going to be doing any driving today. Right, crack on. It's coming to me, yeah, it's going to get some floor insulation. I don't know why. I don't know why. Floor insulation and some of that foam um, spray. spray. Insulation spray. Yeah, so I think I'm going to go down B and Q and have a look. Just pulled up for a bit of breakfast, boys. Down Abbott and Park, big old Victorian park in Northampton. Not a bad little setting, is it? what it's all about boys just being able to pull away any time and set up home anywhere by the 
Just pulled over, boys, for a little celebration. Liverpool losing their sixth home game. Happy days. Look at this, boys. It's a different world, isn't it? Robots delivering groceries. And well done for the, the coach as well. I mean, he's done a great, great job there. Understanding when to change it. Seeing who was your The old diesel's getting a bit low, boys. I've just chopped it up with a fiver on my way to my auntie's now. Give her a little surprise. Go on, Clock, cry us a river, son. Cry us a river, you fucking fairy. Goal denying record. So you cannot concede goals. In the moment when you don't score a lot, what the opposite do, then you need you need you need tight results. But positive tight results, like a one nil and then fight hard and, and maybe that you block a ball on the line, all these kind of things. And that's why we have to go to get through to get to and not um <laughs> just Is it a penalty? Isn't it a penalty? First minute of the Derby, United City. Denied the area. Denied the area. So penalty is confirmed. I'm sure it will. I love Robbie Savage. I hate Hanson. Hanson hates United. Savage was a it was a United boy in the class of '92. Go on, Robbie Savage. Savage. Come on, I'm at a, I'm at the lights now. So it's Bruno Fernandes against Edison. This to give Manchester United the lead against Manchester City. They haven't been behind in their last 19 Premier League matches. Bruno Fernandes sets out to the left, then shoots low, and Edison got a hand to it but couldn't keep it out. Get in! Get in there, boys! And Bruno defeat since November, and it's Manchester United who are 2 0 up. Incredible. Happy days. Let's give Henderson. I'm going to make someone's day now. Happy birthday, Jonah. I just was in uh, the Boondockers live. Couldn't say nothing because uh, I've only got 300 bloody subscribers. I love all, each and every one of you. But since day dot, since I even got on YouTube, I've had like little stalkers, little trolls, you know what I mean? Probably one in the back there fell over. Um, so my birthday gift to you, Jonah, is... You said you didn't want me calling you late at night, boy. My birthday gift to you, Jonah, is no more phone calls. <laughs> He's going to give a round of applause. No, uh, have a good birthday, Jonah. Take care, brother. All the best. Growler. Uncle Tuna. Have a happy birthday, brother. I'll just see you on the lives on the boonies, mate. Have a good one, mate, and don't get too drunk on the old chocolate digestives. So in the van, it's half eleven, just about to finish up, been on it all day. Got really nothing done because it just takes forever. Now, I'm planning my first trip to Scotland. When the lockdown's over, it looks like mid-July. So Wendy, don't think I forgot about you, love. Don't think I, don't think I forgot about you, Wendy, Wu. Um... I'm going to go and terrorise Les, Jonah, and all the motherfucking, motherfucking Scotland. I'm not going to do that NFC, whatever it's called, 500 malarkey. I just want to go and see the dark sides of Scotland. Dark sides. 
I'll spend about 20 minutes with Jonah. I'll try and get rid of him. Happy birthday. I've done it already two, twice. If he shaved that beard off, he'd look about 12, the fucker. Soap dodger. Anyway, guys. Um, lean like Steve McQueen. Nothing else to say. I'm fucked. Good night. God bless. Take care.